against village altars war against war against village altars in the name of Jesus and we read a scripture before we begin it's in the book of Luke chapter 10 and it's verse 19 and Jesus is telling us something go with me Luke 10 Luke 10, 19, I want to read it. Behold, I give you the authority to trample on serpents and scorpions and over all the power of the enemy. Mm -hmm. And nothing shall by any means hurt you. Praise the Lord. Nothing, mm -hmm. like nothing. Nothing stands for everything that is anything. It, mm. it, it is nullified by the word nothing shall by any means harm you. So uh, when we are looking at the village, we know that we have people, okay, they are there nowadays in our neighborhood. Eh? People who keep snakes, they have pots, they put their snakes there. Others put what? They keep lions, leopards, tortoise, tortoise elephants, any kind of an animal. Because you see, when these people are going to their uh what do you call it to their covenant meetings they go via every means others are riding on uh, what do you call them mats others are riding on brooms others are in sufurias and others are riding on animals praise god and especially areas where we have night runners they ride on animals you 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 can meet with a man or a woman who is riding a leopard and they are She's she's using it like a horse and she's going to meetings. She's I mean, for somebody to be riding on a lion in the middle of the night, where are they going? <laughs> you know, where are they going, Lindsay? <laughs> you just meet somebody about you, a lion <laughs> in the middle of the night. So those are some of the things that people see. So these people, when they are riding on these animals, that's when or cows, bulls, buffaloes, funny, funny, strange animals. That's when you find such a, an animal running after you, chasing you in the dream. Because that villager, that is an evil operator, an evil priest, an evil priestess, she's operating on that village altar where they manipulate people from on their generation lines. This is not generational caste. This is not generational, you know, downloads and inheritance things. This is oppression from a central point from your roots. You know, they pull strings that are tying you to that village and they use those cords to follow through every person in that generation. It's an outward, uh, it's it's not an internal thing. It's not from your grandfather seeing no. Some people bewitched your family and they decided in this village, every male will be like this. Every male will be like this. So those evil uh, elders in such villages, you remember... An evil altar will never go dry. There is always somebody born to inherit. Praise the Lord. Mm. So by the way, if you say, hey, my, grand, my great grandfather was a witch. There is a witch or a wizard in your lineage because when your grandfather dies, somebody else must step up. You know, somebody else must step up into it. Quavo, we are dealing with war against village altars and I want you to focus on your village. The first thing I want us to really really destroy is demonic eyes that are monitoring your progress monitoring your marriage monitoring your family monitoring your health monitoring anything in your life from that and reporting to that altar in jesus name so i want you to gorge out every evil eye every evil means of monitoring you you know some of these people we meet from the village you know, they just come, they're looking for work in your area and you host them. You know, some of those people, I'm going to teach you about mobile altars. Some of those people are mobile altars. They are the windows through which your village can survey you, can look at you. They are people who walk and there's a spirit in them. When they sit, they, what do you call it, friends? Is it to zoom out? The one you zoom out and zone out. So you zone out, they zone out. And the demon is now surveying you. I've seen these people who sit and they give you strange looks. And if you do, hey, 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 nini, they say, akuna, 
Why are you looking at me like that? Uh -uh. It's not them. It's a spirit surveying you. It's a spirit looking at you. A spirit listening to you. And that spirit in them can even jump out during the night. Can visit, come through the walls, listen in your bedrooms, Musonia, what you're deciding, what you're talking about. And then you wonder when some old people in your village, they've got information. When you try to say, Ninani eh, aliskia yo? We say, no, 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 atu pongembele so and so. We didn't, even when we discussed that she was not here. So they, there are people, even the village altars can send and assign people who will be reporting, will, will be, they, they will be used as a window to look into your life and report back to them in the name of Jesus. I want you to start by thanking God because of his mercies, because of his goodness. Hallelujah. Father, we thank you for your goodness. We thank you for your mercies. We thank you because you're a good God. Thank you for life. Thank you for preserving me, Lord. Thank you because you're the Alpha and the Omega, the forever faithful, forever unchanging, forever merciful. Your faith for a lifetime of God. When we are not faithful, you remain faithful. We were Thank you, Father, for being an amazing God. Thank you, Father. Thank you, Father, for the wonders and the miracles that are shown. Father of God, thank you for the blessing of all of us. We have been blessed by the Lord. Thank you for this day, Almighty Father. I worship you, exalt Thank you, King of Glory, for the grace to pray. Thank you for your faith. Thank you, my dear. Monitoring my life to report back to the village altar. Mm -hmm. In the name of Jesus, I got you out. Any means that they use from my village to acquire information and knowledge about me and concerning me. In the mighty name of Jesus, the great, the mighty name of Jesus. The every evil eye. Monitoring me from an evil altar in the village. So I pray right now in the mighty name of Jesus Christ, Son of the Living God. I command you to lose your power in the mighty name of Jesus. I call you out right now in the mighty name of Jesus. Every evil eye, monitoring my life from the from every village eye. So I pray in the mighty name of Jesus Christ, Son of the Living God. I command you to lose your power in the mighty name of Jesus. I am rendering you powerless in the mighty name Jesus Christ, Son of the Living God, I render your powerless by the power in the mighty name of Jesus. I render your powerless in the mighty name of Jesus. Everything things they are using to monitor my life from any evil eyes in the spirit. I pray the mighty name of Jesus Christ, Son of the Living God. Your power in the mighty name of Jesus Christ, Son of the Living God. Your power in the mighty name of Jesus Christ, Son of the Living God. Lose your power in the mighty name of Jesus Christ, I pray the mighty name of Jesus Christ, Son of the Living God. Every evil heart, God is sharing my life from any evil heart of the living God. I pray the mighty name of Jesus Christ, Son of the Living God. I pray the Jesus Christ, Son of the Living God. I call you out. Right now, I am going to now in the mighty name of Jesus Christ, Son of the Living God. I am going to now in the mighty name of Jesus Christ, Son of the Living God. I in the mighty name of Jesus. Son of the Living God. I pray the mighty name of Jesus. I got you out right now. Your evil eye. Monitoring yes, my life from yes, any yes, evil yes, outside yes, the village. Yes, I pray the mighty name of Jesus Christ, yes, Son of the Living God. I call yes, you yes, out yes, right yes, now. Lose yes, your power. I want you to kill every strange animal. 
their mind today. That is roaming around in your village against your destiny. Mm. Killing Every strange animal. Roaming around in the village against my you destiny. I pray the mighty name of Jesus Christ, son of the living God. Lose your power in the mighty name of Jesus. I Every strange animal roaming around in the village, pursuing my life. So I pray the mighty name of Jesus Christ, Son of the Living God. I combat you right now by the power in the mighty name of Jesus. Lose your power in the mighty name of Jesus. Every strange animal. Robbing a village at the same time, the mighty name of Jesus Christ, and the living God. I pray that you are in your power, whatever you are in your power, 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 you are I believe on Jesus Christ. Lose your power over my life. Lose your power in my life right now. Lose your power. Your power in the mighty name of Jesus. Fall down and die. Fall down and die. Fall down and die. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, Son of the Living God. Say, pray the mighty name of Jesus. By the power of the glory, by the power in the mighty name of Jesus, every switch rocking around in the village. I get us, my life. Is I pray the mighty name of Jesus? There you go. Who is the power of 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 the Every strength in my village, robbing around, test my life. This is where the fight is about Jesus. Who's about you know when we talk about strange animals when you think about your villagers you know your village you know, there are some homes where they keep Kitukama to a roster, a jogo. Mm. Since you were a baby, that cook was just there. Yeah. It has grown old over 20 years. It is not dying. You know, mm. there are places where they have strange gods. Okay. Mm. You know, a god that never just dies. No, just, you know, no more animals that when you see them, you, I mean, it's a god. You call it Maria. So Maria has been there. Maria has given birth to over 50 goats. She, she never dies. She, she's never old. Maria is just there. That Maria is the one who is chasing you in the night. Yeah? And when you call her Maria, she comes running. She even identifies people. Have you ever seen those strange animals? Mm -hmm. And we are happy. Yeah. You know, places where they just keep a karoxy. You know, a kadogi too. Mm -hmm. The dog is just there, Simba, Simba. Since you were babies, you were going to pre-unit, Simba was escorting you. Mm -hmm. Now you are married, Simba is meeting you with your children. Now you have a Simba never dies. You know, strange animals. They are there. They just camouflage as, you know, normal things. But more stranger are those now that they ride the evil breeders in the village. They breed them leopards and, you know, hyenas and everything, and they ride them in the night. So when you're praying against strange animals, you had better just destroy. Because you see, these strange animals, they are the strange things like if you 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 are maybe a Maasai, no konangombe zako. This is the thing that will come into your farm, choose like 10 cows and leaves. That's a strange hyena. You understand? Mm. They are they are bred by people there. They are even traded. There are people who have them for sale. Like you want to go and terrorize Pharaoh's home. I have my cuckoos. They sleep outside and you want to terrorize me. So you go and buy an hyena from a seller in the village. The ones that they sell at night. You choose one and you release it in my home. It eats my dogs, eats my everything. When I wake up, there is an hyena that is terrorizing people. A lion that is, it is not a lion. 
it is, you know, a strange elephant just comes into your farm, stampeds everything, destroys properties and just disappears. That, that elephant did not pass any other farm. It just came to your farm. These are destructive things. If you are a cow, you know, we have it in our culture where our great, some of us are not even far, maybe three generations from us, mm -hmm. they used to go and drink in Sudan mm -hmm. and then they come back home. Friends, Sudan and here, midnight, your grandfather will be here in the next 10 minutes. They are there, your grandfather with somebody else's grandfather. They are there, my grandfather too, like 10 of them. So they drink, drink, drink when it is 10. They say, now we are going home, we are men. And then they, they now say, let's scatter, let's meet tomorrow. They now get in the forest. What, you, you just hear sounds, they are turning into animals. Some become birds, eagles, snakes, whatever they want to become. And now they go home. Imagine. It used to be fun. If somebody can turn themselves into an animal to go home, and even today, I know of a girl. If you annoy her, what happens? A snake. A snake. You see now me, I live in a, in a flat. Eh? A snake here, first floor, it's not easy. But a snake will appear here and see. Just because you really annoyed her. It is in this, she's in Renzi's generation, right? So it is my daughter's generation. What is happening to her parents and her grandparents in this dispensation? So strange animals from the village assigned to terrorize your family. Mm -hmm. Kill them in the name of Jesus oh, Christ. Assigned to follow you around like a dog, just following you everywhere you're going. Let them fall down and die. In the strange animal, hundred against you. As I pray, the mighty name of Jesus Christ, my Lord, let us fall down and die. Let us die in the name of Jesus Christ. Fall down and die in the mighty name of Jesus. Fall down and die in the mighty name of Jesus Christ, the living God. So I pray the mighty name of Jesus. Every strange animal in my village that has been assigned to terrorize my life. So I pray the mighty name of Jesus Christ, Son of the Living God. I command you to lose your power in the mighty name of Jesus. Fall down and die. Fall down and die in the mighty name of Jesus. Fall down and die in the mighty name of Jesus. Fall down and die in the mighty name of Jesus. Lose your power and die. Lose your power and die right now. In the mighty name of Jesus. Fall down and die in the mighty name of Jesus. Lose your power and die right now. In the mighty name of Jesus. Fall down and die in the mighty name of Jesus. Lose your power and die right now. That has been assigned to the right by life. So I pray the mighty name of Jesus Christ, Son of the Living God. Fall down and die right now in the mighty name of Jesus. Fall down and die in the mighty name of Jesus. Fall down and die in the mighty name of Jesus. Fall down and die in the mighty name of Jesus. Fall down and die in the mighty name of Jesus. Fall down and die in the mighty name of Jesus. Fall down and die in the mighty name of Jesus. Fall down and die in the mighty name of Jesus. Fall down and die in the mighty name of Jesus. Fall down and die in the mighty name of Jesus. Fall down and die in the mighty name of Jesus. Fall down and die in the mighty name of Jesus. Fall down and die in the mighty name of Jesus. Fall down and die in the mighty name of Jesus. Fall down and die in the mighty name of Jesus. Fall down and die in the mighty name of Jesus. Fall down and die in the mighty name of Jesus. Fall down and die in the mighty name of Jesus. Fall down and die in the mighty name of Jesus. Fall down and die in the mighty name of Jesus. Fall down and die in the mighty name of Jesus. Fall down so I pray the mighty name of Jesus. Lose your power and die in the mighty name of Jesus. Lose your power and die. By the power in the mighty name of Jesus. Lose power and die in the mighty name of Jesus. Lose power and die in the mighty name of Jesus. Lose power and die in the mighty name of Jesus. Every great animal that has been assigned to the rise by light of the demon. Lose your power and die in the mighty name of Jesus. Lose your power and die in the mighty name of Jesus. Lose your power in the fight of the Lose your power in the fight of the devil. Lose your power in the fight of the devil. Lose your power in the fight of the devil. Lose your power in the fight of the devil. Lose your power in the fight of the devil. Lose your power in the fight of the devil. Lose your power in the fight of the devil. Lose your power in the fight of the devil. Lose your power in the fight of the devil. Lose your power in the fight of the devil. Lose your power in the fight of the devil. Items, your belongings, your books, your pencils, school bag, old shoes, undergarments, air that you comped. Nail that you chopped, soil that you walked upon, any item, anything 
that is tying me, representing me on the village altar. Mm. Some they use, uh, what do they use when they go to the witch doctor and you're not there? Money. Mm -mm. The one that represents you. Come yes. on, Atibua. Maybe you are burnt. They use a piece of wood, mm. you know. If, if, if your parents go to a witch doctor and you refuse to go and your siblings have gone, they will take a, a small rod and say, now this is where mm -hmm. <laughs> they will bring something on that altar to represent you. So in those village altars, they have something that represents you. Maybe it is soil that they've picked. Maybe it's water that you showered and they picked that wet soil. Your sweat, you know, representing you. Whatever you have your photo, your shoes, your anything that is yours that they could easily get. Praise the Lord. Mm. If that altar is mainly fighting your education, they will have your books. Mm. If it is fighting maybe your prosperity, they will have your soil mm. or your shoes or your socks or something that is connecting you. I want you to visit that altar now in the spiritual realm and set trauma, set a blaze. Whatever it is that is connected, any item, whatever it is, let it burn to ashes in the name of Jesus. Anything that belongs to you, to your person, I provide you to fire in the mighty name of Jesus. Your finances, the mighty name of Jesus Christ, all of the living. And I and evil village altar. They pray right now in the mighty name of Jesus Christ, Son of the Living God. Lose your power in the mighty name of Jesus. Catch fire right now in the mighty name of Jesus. Catch fire in the mighty name of Jesus Christ, Son of the Living God. Back to ashes right now in the mighty name of Jesus Christ, Son of the Living God. Back to ashes right now in the mighty name of Jesus. Okay, they will be sent in the evil village. As I pray, the mighty name of Jesus Christ, Son of the Living God. Back to ashes right now. 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 In the name of Jesus, be consumed by the fire of God in the mighty name of Jesus. Be consumed by the fire of God in the mighty name of Jesus. By the Lord, it presented me and the evil village army. Is the great fight of Jesus. I pray the mighty name of Jesus. Be destroyed right now in the mighty name of Jesus. Be destroyed right now in the mighty name of Jesus. My father, my father, is I pray and Father, 
Yes, I pray the mighty name of My Father, my Father, I will speak of the there's something that we cannot forget. Praise the Lord. Amen. Most of us in our villages, we have this one mega tree eh? in the shopping areas and everywhere. We There's that tree, that tree of witchcraft. In many cases, this tree of witchcraft is a conference hall, is a store, is a warehouse, is anything that can host your blessings. Mm -hmm. Haji, the evil elders or the spiritual people in the village, as you leave to go to look for greener pastures, mm -hmm. they declare they, they can lock up your soul in the village. People whose souls have been locked in their villages, they don't develop where they go. Mm -hmm. You understand? Mm -hmm. They don't feel settled. You find somebody's working in the bank, they are buying people land, they mm -hmm. are buying people houses, they will not buy. The most they can buy is a car because they will go back to the village. You understand? Because you, everything that can make you develop, something that you can desire from your soul, is not here. And you find every piece of land they want to sell in Mukambani, you are the one who is buying. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you are buying land that does not make sense. I've ever bought land locked as an acre that you don't even have a, the way to reach it. You have to pass through somebody's shamba and another shamba for you to get to that land. Mm. And that is the land you bought. You even went for a loan to buy. Your kids are not going to school. It will not benefit you. There's no rain. There's no dam. There's nothing. You can't irrigate it. It is just useless. You're just wasting your money. You can't even build them, Sonia, mm. because it's landlocked. No, no, we talk to the country there. Mm. You can't get to them. That is because you are, your soul are, is in that tree. Mm -hmm. They've put your life in that tree. They can put in every family, they can they can say, every family in this village, the first one will be useless. The last one will be what we call the black sheep. Mm -hmm. Is there anyone who was born with God having a mark at it? This is the black sheep. Is there anything mm -hmm. like that in the Bible? Mm -hmm. So what makes people black sheep? You understand? Mm -hmm. They are the ones who paint. The, we paint the last born or the second last born. Every first born daughter will be a prostitute. You know, you can be a, a classical prostitute that nobody knows you're a prostitute, but mm. you are a prostitute. You understand? Mm. So they lock the good things in those trees. They Those trees, they become, you know, custodian of your, they, they, they hold custody of good things. Anything good in your life is found in that tree in the village. So mm. for you even to maybe do well, you have to do something in the village. If you, you you do farming in your half an acre, at least you can get three guneas of maize and you are being praised in the whole village. You see how you're prospering in the village. And now you decide you will even resign so that you go and become wow. a farmer. <laughs> Praise God. So anything of yours that is stored in any tree in the village or in any rock, they use also rocks, this, you know, those massive rocks that just happen to be in the village somewhere behind somebody's shamba there they can store your good there you left you went to you went to the city you got married to a girl who's not even from your 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 your, your tribe but you, peace in your marriage you left it in the village mm. so everybody's complaining do you know do you wonder why some girls complaining when they marry village boys mm. or when you marry a girl from the village do you see how, how many times those marriages do not work but in the real sense, somebody went to marry a girl from the village because they knew she's good, only to discover they married a witch. She's worse than those ones who went to school. What is your good that is left in the village? Maybe your, your father left the your grandfather left the village long time ago, but they still follow your lineage to steal from you because they, they can monitor, they see, they see where you are. Like I was teaching the other day. They know what you're doing. They know how many kids you have. They know wh who is shining and who is not shining. And they've already put their mark. Basically, the child is born to pay for something that happened before they were even born. Praise God. Mm -hmm. So, in that village tree, I want you to go and take it out. Command the angels of God to visit any area in your village that has any good that belongs to you, retrieve it to you, bring it back to you, give it back to you. Okay. This is the prayer you pray until when you sleep. 
you will dream with a man tapping you like this and giving you an envelope. Oh, you know, tapping you like this and giving you some keys. Tapping you like this and giving you a basket or a present because you've gone for them. Ask it shall be given. I want you to go to your village. Oh, release I the angels of God, God in your village. I release oh, you right now to my village. In the mighty name of Jesus. In the mighty name of Jesus. Jesus. I release you like right you now in the mighty name of Jesus Christ, what out of the living God. Restore it right now by the power in the mighty name of Jesus. Angels of God, angels of God. I release you right now to my village in the mighty name of Jesus. Locate every tree. All this by good in the mighty name of Jesus Christ, Son of the living God. Look at every tree, all this by good in the mighty name of Jesus. Look at every rock, all this by good in the mighty name of Jesus. Look at everything, all this by good in the mighty name of Jesus. By the power of the mighty name of Jesus Christ, Son of the living God. Yes, I pray the mighty name of Jesus Christ, Son of the living God. Oh, angels of God. Look at anywhere in my village. Where am I going is being held in the mighty name of Jesus Christ, son of the living God. I pray the mighty son of the living God. My Father in God. In the name of Jesus. I pray the mighty name of Jesus Christ, son of the living God. Anywhere my good is being held. I pray the mighty name of Jesus Christ, son of the living God. Oh, angels of God. Look. Get Angels of God, I release you right now in the mighty name of Jesus, the Son of the Living God. Look anywhere in my village, where my good is being held. I will restore it in the mighty name of Jesus, the Son of the Living God. Restore it right now by the power in the mighty name of Jesus. Restore it right now by the power in the mighty name of Jesus, the Son of the Living God. Let me pray the mighty name of Jesus, the Son of the Living God. By the power in the mighty name of Jesus, angels of God, I release you right now. By the power in the mighty name of Jesus, in the mighty name of Jesus Christ, Son of the Living God, mighty Father, King of Glory, is I pray the mighty name of Jesus Christ, Son of the Living God, anywhere in my God is is I pray the mighty name of Jesus. Disconnect yourself from every evil ties to the village altar as we finish. Mm -hmm. In the mighty name of Jesus. I disconnect myself right now from any evil ties in my village in the mighty name of Jesus. I disconnect myself right now from any evil ties in the mighty name of Jesus. I disconnect myself right now from any evil ties in my village in the mighty name of Jesus. Yes, I pray the mighty name of Jesus. I disconnect myself right now from any evil ties in my village in the mighty name of Jesus. Every evil tie in my village. So I pray the mighty name of Jesus, the Son of the Living God, lose your hold over my life right now. Lose your hold over my life right now in the name of Jesus, the Son of the Living God. Every evil tie to the life. I pray the mighty name of Jesus. I pray the mighty name of Jesus. Please for me right now. I disconnect myself from Jesus in the mighty name of Jesus. I disconnect myself. I disconnect myself. I disconnect myself. I disconnect myself. I disconnect 